A man standing on the top of a tower throws a ball straight up with initial velocity v i and at the same time throws a second ball straight downward with the same speed. Which ball will have large speed and when it strikes the ground? Ignore air friction. So we see that uh, at tower when uh, this ball is thrown vertically upward and this ball is uh, uh, he throws downward uh, in simple way so in this case we have two different case uh, it covers uh, some time to read this time but we uh, we uh, know that if we ignore air friction so if we ignore the air friction two bodies uh, will get the same velocities in the uh, in the absence of air so we can say that the ball which is thrown vertically up this ball with velocity v i will have same velocity v i when it reaches back to the top of the tower. So the two balls have the same downward velocity at the top of tower. So they hit the ground with same final velocities. However, difference in uh, time we can say that they, um, they have different time but the speed will be same in both cases.